Speed key menus on Passport Point of Sale make transactions quick and easy for cashiers. And you can add a deeper dimension to your speed keys with secondary and sub-menus. Secondary menus can be used to represent a category, like coffee bar, and contain multiple choices, like coffee or lattes. Submenus let you drill down even further to categories like coffee cup sizes. Gilbarco recommends that before configuring your speed key menus, you plan your primary, submenu, and secondary menus. Start by configuring your sub and secondary menus to be assigned to a primary menu. To set up secondary and submenus, start at the manager's workstation. Go to Setup, Register, then Speed Key Maintenance. Select the Add button, enter your key menu description, which will be the name of your secondary or submenu. Set the menu level to secondary or submenu depending on the type of menu you're creating and select an empty position on the speed key grid. Tap the Add Key button and enter or search for the PLU or UPC code to assign the key. Select the icon and continue the process to fill out your menu. When you're done, select Save. To assign your secondary or sub-menu to a primary menu, go to your primary menu and select the Change button. Select an empty spot on the grid and tap the Add Key button. Select your secondary or sub-menu from the Menu ID drop-down list. Give your key an icon and select Save. You can add multiple secondary or sub-menus to the primary speed key menu by simply repeating the process. Now, you're ready to take the customization of your passport system to a whole new level.